Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Last Cast Outdoors. Today I'm going to be doing a review on this Lost Creek two-person ice fishing tent. Let's hop right into it. So you might know Sportsman's Warehouse owns Lost Creek. This is their smallest one they have. This is a two-person ice fishing tent. If you are just starting out with ice fishing and want to get into it, this is a great little ice tent to get started. It is the smallest ice tent you can get and it's also the cheapest as well. First, we're gonna talk about the most important things about this ice fishing tent, which is the dimensions and the weight. So let's talk about the dimensions. It is 59 inches lengthwise and widthwise. The height is 67 inches high. To translate that in feet, you are looking about length and widthwise about three feet. Height wise is about five, seven. So if you are taller than five feet, seven inches, you will not be able to stand in this ice fishing tent. I definitely cannot stand. You're gonna be crouching in there, but once you're sitting in there with a chair, it is just fine. There is plenty of room. Now about the weight, this thing weighs 21 pounds. This is really light for a two person ice fishing tent. This is very easy to carry. It's easy to pop into your sled take it anywhere you want to. It's really lightweight. Now let's talk about what this is made of. This is made out of a 300 denier polyester fabric. This is a very common fabric in a lot of ice fishing tents. All right, let's talk a little bit more about this tent and some of its features. The first thing I wanna talk about is the color. As you know, Sportsman's Warehouse owns Lost Creek. They love to use the color green. So they did that with all of their Lost Creek ice fishing tents. I think it looks amazing. It stands out among all the Eskimos and clams, which are blue and red. So I'm really happy they went with this beautiful dark green color. You also get this black top, which really helps melt any snow that falls on top of it. Also helps a lot with trapping in that heat, especially because this is not a thermal insulated tent. So this black top definitely helps trap in all of that nice warm heat. Next, this ice fishing tent comes with some nice big windows. You get four of them on each side because this is a four sided ice fishing tent. These are amazing. They're nice and big. You can really choose how much light or how much light you don't want to come in. And I will be talking a little bit more about these windows later on in the video. Next are these pop-up handles. It comes with four of them because this is a four sided ice fishing tent. So you pop those out and then you got one on the roof to pop up. Next, we're gonna talk about these wind acres. You get four of them. You just tie them to your handles however you want to. These are for whenever it's really windy outside. There is a high chance of it actually pushing in your walls, which is kind of scary and dangerous at the same time. So that's why they gave you these wind anchors for. So when it's really windy, you just tie these on or you can have them pre-tied on. Next, you're gonna grab a heavy duty stake. You're gonna screw that inside of the ice. And then this is also adjustable as well. And you can put that right onto that anchor. So when it's all nice and tight, the wind cannot push in your walls, which is really nice. And it helps keep the tent very secure. The one thing I wish they did was put a little pouch here to put all of your cord in so it's nice and organized. It just kind of falls on the ground and I don't really like that. So I wish they put a little pouch in there. That would have been a very nice touch. Now that we're done talking about the outside of the Lost Creek two person ice fishing tent, let's go inside and show you what it has to offer. As you can tell, you do not get a whole lot of space. I do recommend this to be a one person tent. For it being so small on the inside, it is a lot nicer just using this as a one person ice fishing tent but you can definitely cram in two people and that's it. So like I said, you get four really nice big windows. These things are amazing. These are standard on all of the Lost Creek ice fishing tents. I like how big they are. You can let in a lot of light or you can just Velcro them back on and have it completely pitch black in here. Next up, you only get one storage pouch. You can use that for your keys, wallet, phone, whatever you want to. And then it also comes with one and two exhaust ports. As you can see, that's what they look like. These are meant for if you're using a heater buddy in here or if you're actually using an auger in here to drill some holes. This will help get rid of all of those fumes. Make sure you guys pop these open when you're doing that. It is a huge safety thing. And then one more cool thing about these windows, this is like a plastic all sealed with Velcro. So if you want to let some air in or vent out even more, you can just pull that Velcro 
and you can do that if you want to remove the actual window itself. And that is pretty much everything you need to know about this Lost Creek two-person ice fishing tent on the inside. Next, we're gonna talk about what you get in the bag with your ice fishing tent. You get eight heavy-duty ice stakes. These are meant for your anchor points and also your wing guides as well. If you can get a drill adapter to drill these in, it makes it a lot more easier than doing it by hand, but they are very sharp and pointy, so they do go into the ice really fast, even if you are just hand tightening it. Also in the bag, of course, you get your four wing guides. You also get a strap, so when you break down your tent, you can strap it so it stays shut and can go in that bag a lot easier. And you get a patch as well in case you make any cuts or slash it. Now we're gonna talk about the most important part of this video. Is this Lost Creek two-person ice fishing tent worth it? Well, I can tell you that it absolutely is. I do personally love this ice fishing tent and I wanna tell you some things I really like about this ice fishing tent. First is the color. With this ice fishing tent not being insulated, this dark green color with the black top and the black interior, it really helps trap in that heat. The next thing I really like about this ice fishing tent are these windows. You get four really big windows. This is really nice to see just because if you have them all open, it does make the inside feel a lot more spacious. And overall, I just really like it because it's so easy to pop up and it is very lightweight, only weighs 21 pounds. It's easy to throw into the sled or put it on your back and carry it with you. It is very easy to move, especially when it's popped up. It is easy just to move it around. I can literally go inside, stand up and just move it to wherever I want. And there isn't a lot of things I dislike about this ice fishing tent. It does everything I need it to do. The only thing I wish it came with was a little pouch to hold your wing guides. That's pretty much the only thing. So if you ever do walk into a sportsman's warehouse and you see this Lost Creek two-person ice fishing tent, should you buy it? I think so. If you're looking for a two-person tent just to get you started, something that's basic, then yes, I do recommend buying it. This one retails for $180. That is very cheap for an ice fishing tent and everything that comes with it, it is definitely a great value for sure. Now let's talk about the other side, if this Lost Creek two-person ice fishing tent is worth it. What I'm talking about is probably its biggest competitor, which is an Eskimo Quick Fish 2. That is Eskimo's two-person ice fishing tent. So let's talk about that if you are comparing those two. They both have the same dimensions, 59 inches lengthwise and widthwise, and 67 inches high. They both weigh 21 pounds, and they use the same fabric, which is a 300 denier polyester fabric. And the last thing they have in common is the price. They both retail for $180. They are pretty much the same thing. Now, the one thing that Eskimo does have going for them, they are probably the most popular ice fishing brand out there. So a lot of people trust them and use their tents a lot. The one big difference I've noticed between the two of them is the windows. So the Quick Fish 2 have really small windows, but through the Lost Creek, you get these really nice big windows. That is pretty much the biggest thing cosmetically wise between the Lost Creek two-person ice fishing tent and the Eskimo Quick Fish 2. All right, that's gonna be the end of this video. This was my review of the Lost Creek two-person ice fishing tent. This is a nice little ice fishing tent to take with you if you're just starting out or a person like me that's been doing it for a while. It's so easy to take it anywhere you want. It's super portable, lightweight. If you guys have any questions, let me know in the comments down below and I will see you guys on the next episode. See ya.